Youth across the country have been charged to ensure they stamp their feet in the political space of the country by ensuring total participation in the coming 2023 general elections. Deputy National Youth Director of the APC Presidential Campaign Council, Nicholas Felix, gave the charge while addressing party faithful in his hometown in his own southeast local government area of Edo State. The party's faithful assured of a resounding victory for its presidential candidate alongside other candidates of the party in the 2023 general elections. I've repeated this every, in every interview. Every youth you. out there that is marching, that is getting involved in politics, I commend their effort. From the state zonal level to the states, to ward, to local government, ward and to every unit. As soon as the uh, inauguration is done and our flag off is done, we're going to be going around the 36 states of the Federation in galvanizing and speaking to the youth, the essence of them voting for the right candidate. We need a bold president who will take some bold decision in ending the insecurity in this land. That's why we must vote for Senator Bola Ametinibu. We are very confident and happy that our illustrious son is uh, being given such opportunity and position to help galvanize our people. We are expecting so much from him. To, to whom much is given, sometimes much is also expected from that person. In all honesty, personally, he's my brother, he's my younger brother. I'm very proud to, to say that. And I'm very happy that I have somebody personally out there. And I believe my local government also think the same way with me. Come 2023, in APC, all the candidates in APC will win. Our Jagaban will be the next president of this country. We are moving around, and sorry that our candidates they all came out victorious. We are moving from one place to another, reaching out to even in the marketplace, telling them about this our party, about the needful, about, the, about how they will come up and vote for our candidates, most especially the, from the presidency down to the local government the state. Well, as the 2023 general elections draw near, the police command in Nasarawa State has warned political parties and their supporters to shun all forms of electoral violence as they go about their campaigns. Commissioner of Police in the state, Adishin Osoemi, gave the warning during a meeting with state chairman, secretaries of political parties, and the resident electoral commissioner of the Independent National Electoral Commission in Lafia. He explained that the meeting was in compliance with the directive of the Inspector General of Police, Ali Kalibaba, to ensure the successful conduct of the forthcoming general election. I warn individuals whose perception of democracy is the application of violence to have a routine because the police are committed to dealing firmly with such characters within the dictates of the law. As a law abiding citizen of Nigeria, we are going to ensure our people to talk to them. They should follow the rules and regulations of the land. As, as a political party, the ruling party, we are showing every we are showing the police and I like that will certainly play in accordance with the extant laws of the land. And we know the crisis that has been going on in this country. We are trying as a party to even avoid it internally. Talk of now that he has made it as an emphasis and law of the country. Definitely we are going to uh, enlighten our people very, very well on the issue of Togri and whatever that will cause chaos in these elections that are coming 2023. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.